Hey everyone, this is DL Tillery coming at you with the next video in my Steps Before Outlining series. Today's video is about building your novel's world. A decent amount of time goes into building your novel's world. It's detailed work involved. After you ask yourself these five questions that I'm going to give you, then you can go into research for your world building. Number one. What does your world look like? I always think about what my world looks like before I go in any further into the world creation. Is it a dark world? Is it a light world? Is it a world in turmoil? Is it a balanced world? Is it a world based off of my world? Am I creating a whole new world? What does your world look like? Is it pastures of green? Is it mostly water? Is your world... Does your world have five suns? Does your world only have three hours of light per day or something like that? I literally mean the world. On the world. One, that one question, what does your world look like? Give it some thought, literally. Like, what do you think your world looks like? It might be an easy question for you. It might not be writing something that you're creating your own world. It might be using the world in which you live in now, which gives makes the question a little bit easier and take a little bit less time because you know the world you live in and what planet you live on. I'm thinking about planet build because if you're if you're building it off of our world and it's in our world, then that's less you have a little bit less detail to worry about as far as the world literally planet. Question number two, grounded in reality or not? So is your story grounded in our reality or is it a whole nother reality that you created? Definitely think about that one. It's going to matter about the story's placement, your character's place of birth, which I talked about in character creation. Knowing your world before you do your character creation is a good idea. Especially since the world around your character is going to affect them. So definitely you want to know if your world is grounded in reality or not in reality. In our reality that we know. Yeah, depends on what kind of book you're writing. Definitely. Question number three. A peaceful world or a driven world or a balanced? This was connected to question number two. Is your world a peaceful world? Is it calm and nice and no one fights at all? Or is it a war-driven world where everyone fights all the time and killing and murder and carnage and things? Or is there a balance? Is there a balance between good and evil that, you know, affects how the world is laid out? Or is there no good and evil and just gray or unquestionable things? Question number four. What type of beings live in your world? Is this world a human world? Is it a humanoid world? Meaning something similar to humans. Is this a world of angels? Is this a world of werewolves? Is this a world of some alien race that you created? So think about what kind of beings are in your world. Are there multiple types of beings? Giving that thought, it will also lead you to what kind of story you're writing as well. Question number five. Is your world based off of our world or based off of a world you created all on your own? Are you going to base your world off of that? You know the structure of our world. Are you going to base your structure of your world, your laws, your governments, if you have governments, are you going to base those things off of what you know from our world? Or are you going to come up with your own completely thing? So. That these questions will help you get to that. Give your give these questions a try. Really ask yourself. Let me know how it turns out. I'd love to have these conversations in the comments with you. All right. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next.